How did I first get into music? Uh, it's a very layered question. Um, there's like different points of like context before like I went like full fledged. But the first time I performed in front of people was uh, at my high school um, walkout rally. I, um, there was like a trap for the national anthem there. And um, I had just happened to join choir um, my last what's it called, like quarter of senior year. Um, and uh, through that, I found out about the tryouts and I was like, all right, well, I'll try it and see what it is because this is something that like, I'm secretly passionate about. And this is like the last time I'll uh, see all these people. So let's see what happens. I tried out, got the tryout and then um, got to do it in front of, you know, my, my graduating class and in high school. And that was the first time like I actually got into doing it. When I got to UCSB in 2012, that's when I started like like making music a part of my life. I joined an acapella group called Beefalm. Shout out to Buds from Other Mothers. You guys made me. But then it wasn't until like 20, I'll say 2013 or so, um, when I like started to put out like real, you know, like my first real, you know, piece of work, like out on streaming platforms and everything. So basically since 2013, onwards I've been like professionally doing it. Everybody had their plans and stuff for 2020 obviously. Um, my big plan was to focus more on like live shows and venues and um, try to see if I could put a tour together. Um, so that was out of the question. So that was probably the um, I guess most difficult part of 2020 was figuring out how to replace you know that kind of um, tour aspect because what I wanted to do is use it as a way you know to build like real connections with people and you know actually meet people where they are and have people meet me as a person as well as an artist you know what I'm saying so and that was like a big part of like my I guess planning for the year and like my um, my goals for that specific year and everything just went to wash so I had to like you know readjust and be like okay so what can I do now what are different ways that you know I can kind of reach people so that was the most challenging part I think for 2020 was just figuring out how to adjust to that assess like why you want to do it do you want to do it because you love it or do you want to do it because you love the quote-unquote attention you might get from it so it's, those are two separate things so first of all analyze those things once you've analyzed that then one like put something out or whatever it is like complete something and then do it again and then do it again, and then do it again, and then do it again. Like, you have to be willing to be embarrassed, flat out. You gotta be willing to be embarrassed and then grow from that. And if you're not, then that's where you need to reevaluate. You know what I'm saying? You can't get better if you don't know where you start from in the first place.